Good morning. It is March the 16th, 2023, coming to you from the Royal Princess en route to Hawaii. Anyhow, out here in the middle of the Pacific, I wanted to talk about the trailer that I just put up a video on, talking about the additional ways to receive onboard credit, money, dinero, or dollars on your next cruise and all of your cruises through different avenues. So here is the cheat sheet I am putting up right here, additional dollars and the four different ways, CCL, gift cards, military, and first responders. And I'm gonna go into each one of those because I'm going to show you here in a little bit my actual onboard credit account. You can screenshot that even if you want to, right there. But I'm gonna go over that and tell you how it works. Okay, first of all, when you cruise a lot, the more free that you can get is always better. And I always say free is best, period. So the first way is buying Carnival stock. Now today it is like in the $8 range okay um, it's under nine dollars a share and you can need to buy 100 shares of carnival stock ccl buy it through any avenue that you want to buy it through whether it's e-trade or charles schwab or morgan uh, stanley or or whoever buy 100 shares of carnival stock and it doesn't ma matter if you have 100 shares or 10,000 shares you only need to buy 100 shares of Carnival stock, CCL. And what that does for you is this, that every 14 day cruise or above on any Carnival brand stocks, Carnival brand brand cruises, which is Holland American, Princess, Carnival, Costa. Um, there's a couple others that are in the Carnival brand like Ada and Kennard, I believe, but mostly just Princess, Holland American, and Carnival. You cruise 14 days on any of those cruise ships, they will give you a $250 additional onboard credit. And it, it comes on your um, account as shareholder benefit, non-refundable. And so it is, I will show you that, but it's 14 day cruises and above, you get $250 of onboard credit, additional. And you can use that on anything. You can use it on excursions, you can use it on spas, you can use it in the gift store, you can use it anywhere. Even very, very, very limited amount, you can use in the casino. But you can use it as anything as onboard credit so that's fantastic now any cruise that is seven days up to 14 days is $100 of additional onboard credit so every seven day cruise that you take you get $100 of additional onboard credit and any cruise that is under seven days mostly on the carnival ships or the carnival itineraries that are three, four, five, six day cruises, you get $50 of additional onboard credit. So if you take, uh, like this Hawaii trip is a 15 day cruise, so it counts as $250 of additional onboard credit. So let me show you this right here. It's a little bit windy outside here today in route to Hawaii. So let me show you my actual statement here, if you can see. You can see here the on the statement and up here at the top it says shareholder benefits and there is my card don't forget to subscribe to my channel and you can always email me at cruising with mark at gmail.com and remember there is no g in cruising with mark 
But you can see right here, the onboard credit. You can see that it says shareholders benefit $250. And then, uh, so that is a fantastic thing. You get it for, for uh, every cruise that you go on. And uh, they don't even ask anything. So how you do it is this. You go to, on Princess, you have to go to a place called SBPCL at princesscruises.com. And if you Google um, Carnival CCL shareholder benefits onboard credit, it will come up and it will tell you uh, actually what Carnival statement says. It will come out on the Carnival letterhead and it will describe how you get $250 each time uh, on on 14 day cruises or above. So take a good hard look at that because it's amazing. It's, it's found money and you don't have to do anything. All you have to do is just send them an email, whether it's through, through Princess, Carnival, or Holland American, send them a, a corresponding email saying what cruise ship you are going on, how many days it's gonna be, um, and it spells this out on their website. Uh, and then you just have to have a copy of your uh, your stock certificate or your CUSPIT number, C-U-S-I-P number. And uh, I've shown that many times on other videos you may want to look at. But you just have to have a copy of your cert stock certificate or you also want to have your reference number given for each uh, of the uh, cruises that you're getting ready to take. So that is a very, very, very important and you're getting free money. So let's go to the next topic, okay? Let's go to something called gift cards. And you can see here, I have gift credit of $200. And, uh, but the gift cards are through AARP. And uh, if you're over the age of 55, you subscribe to AARP for $12 a year as a premier member. And in that um, website, or on that website, you will see discounted gift cards. And they have discounted gift cards for Carnival, uh, Celebrity, Royal Caribbean, and most of the time they have gift cards for Princess. And they are come at 10%. And so you can buy, now I'm gonna tell you a little secret. You can buy 25, $500 gift cards on Carnival every single month. AARP, AARP allows you to buy up to 25 premium gift cards. They don't charge you any kind of service charge or anything for at $500 uh, gift card prices. And so you get those for $450 a piece. So the maxed out number is this. You can buy $12,500 worth of face value Carnival gift cards for $11,250. So, and you can do that every single month. So, you just found $1,250 of additional onboard credit for the investment of $12,500. So, uh, it's not a bad deal. But you can't go into the casino. Trust me, I learned the lesson. You can't go in and, and take $10,000 off of your room, which comes off of your onboard credit gift card account. You can't do that without being, uh, let's use the word flagged. It's not what you want it, where you wanna be. So it's okay to go and put a $1,000 uh, in the casino and work that, and then you, you got $1,000 worth of gift cards for $900, so you, you found $100 of free, free found money. But you don't wanna use it in the casino. You wanna use it on shore excursions. You wanna use it on spa treatments. You wanna use it on things such as that. And if you know anything about spa treatments, you can hit $1,000 in the spa easily. If you take a couple couple massages, you get you know, different kinds of treatments. They have teeth whitening treatments. That's five, $600 right there when you buy the bundle. And uh, so 
you know, you're saving 10%. Plus, if you are an elite on Princess Cruises, you get an additional 10% off all the time on like shore excursions and spa treatments and things such as that. So you're generally saving 20% uh, if you take the 10% there on your elite status and uh, then if you are then getting 10% discounted on your AARP carnival or princess royal or celebrity gift cards so and it's really simple they're emailed to you um, they're emailed to you and then you just take that uh, email take your phone up to the front desk and they will then uh, enter the pin numbers on each one of the gift cards onto your statement onto your onboard credit so it is readily available as soon as they uh, do the pin numbers at the front desk so that's just one one thing that i know it's an additional way to make additional money the next way is to uh, military you know, if you are a retired military or active military, you get a additional onboard credit. And also, if you are a first responder, a fireman, a policeman, a EMT, paramedic, um, any of those, you get additional onboard credit. Um, so that is some of the ways to get additional funds uh, that are out there and so that is the trick and that's my tips but anyhow just remember uh, to subscribe to my channel and till then you'll have a really good day